What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. I am very excited because my favorite pre-workout is Dust Reloaded and Blackstone Labs has come out with a new formula for Dust Reloaded. So if you remember, I always say I can only take half of the scoop and I love stim. I am obsessed with stim and I took the Dust Reloaded when it first came out, took a full scoop. Nobody told me to take a half a scoop and I thought I was gonna have a heart attack. So this is a new formula. So this, from what I'm told, I was told, Kristen, trust me, take a full scoop. So I'm going to take a full scoop of the sour gummy, I think, sour gummy is my favorite. So this is the exact flavor that I take in the original Dust Reloaded. So this is supposed to also give you hydration. There's added hydration. There's obviously energy, pumps, so focus. So I'm excited to try this. I'm a little nervous about a full scoop, but I was told it is safe. So, all right, flavor. Really good. Um, the original one, I think, was actually more grainy, if that makes sense. That might be the right verbiage. This one is very smooth. It's actually completely dissolved. This is delicious. So I'm excited. I'm going to train leg press today, and I'm going heavy. So I'm going to finish this and get to it. If you didn't see my most recent video, there was a, ooh, this is high. There was a leg press video, and I talked about where I got the machine, um, the brand, and some of the things I really like about it. So I am very excited about this because I have not been able to train legs really heavy in a while, so this is very exciting for me. So we are going to just jump right in, and I'm gonna hit for my first set or two, I'm going to kind of move my feet around and just kind of warm up everything. So when you bring your feet really narrow, you're focusing more on your quads. And then really wide focuses more on your glutes. So I'm just kind of engaging everything. So when I do this, I'm actually turning my legs and squeezing. But I'm gonna be using a neutral position for most of these sets. <sighs> okay. We are going to add a plate, and from here on out, I'm going to do 10 reps. That is the goal, as I keep increasing the weight. And like I said before, I'm gonna keep my feet more neutral for the duration of this now. That first set, <laughs> I did so many reps. <sighs> I feel pumped already. <sighs> we are at four plates now. Still feel really good. Um, I'm excited to hit this. All right, here we go. Oh, this feels a little bit heavier than it did before. definitely felt heavier than the last set. It's amazing how one plate on each side makes you feel like that. I'm still gonna go up. This is the heaviest I've gone so far on this particular leg press. 
So one thing that I said about the, this particular leg press in my last video where I kind of introduced that I received this leg press was that the arms are shorter than they would be on like a commercial size piece of equipment. So that limits the number of plates that you can put on. It does have two stacks for plates. I'm hoping I can get more plates on. So I wanted to see how it would all kind of stack up together. So we're gonna see how this goes. I think it looks okay. I think we're gonna be good. So what did I say, five plates? All right. The last set definitely did feel heavy though. So we'll see how this goes. <sighs> Slow and steady. That is all the 45 pound plates that I do have. I'm gonna start putting um, bumper plates on now. So, I'm gonna stack a couple 35s on and go from there. I have six plates on each side, 12 total. And ironically, every set feels heavier than the last. <sighs> okay. Here we go. I'm shaking. Oh, I got a cramp. Okay, we're gonna call it there. Ooh, I got a quad cramp. Okay, well. I've never maxed out this machine before, so I feel comfortable saying that six plates for eight reps is a good starting point for that. Um, feels really good. As far as the pre-workout goes, I am sweating. Um, I actually feel a little bit of a tingle, but not crazy. Like sometimes when there's is it niacin? It makes you like super tingly and your skin all red. I don't feel very red at all. Um, I feel a little tingle. That could be, it could be the pumps coming in. Um, what I do feel is like I'm sweating. I also, like I said, took a full scoop and I don't feel like I'm gonna have a heart attack. So <laughs> that's a good thing too. Um, but it was very good. Uh, definitely got a good workout in and I'm excited to try that pre-workout again. It tasted so good. So if you are looking for a new pre-workout, Blackstone Labs, they're brand new, dust reloaded, reformulated, and better than ever. Make sure you check it out. Kgram SFB at checkout at blackstonelabs.com. And I will see you guys next time.